Quick, somebody call Bruce Willis. And that kid who was in some movies and then he wasn't in movies anymore. And because he's got a Macaulay Culkin face because it looks weird on a grown man. It's just scary. So Paranorman, from the creators of Coraline, that same team, their new stop-motion 3D movie. I really liked Coraline. There was some sinister surrealism nature that it had that I really liked. Definitely a great movie. I can rewatch it, and it's still very good. It's just weird and unsettling, and that's why I like it. This seems to take a different route. It's more towards being, uh, well, it kind of reminds me of, like, Monster House, some, and that. It's actually a pretty good movie. The animation is still good. The story, it's okay. I, I like the way they do it. Uh, you know, it's kind of like that Sixth Sense thing, as I, you know, alluded to earlier. You know, seeing dead people, and then there's this whole zombie thing. Uh, it's a pretty standard Child's Fair uh, storyline where you got the zombies, witches, and ghosts, and such, uh, old curse. But the way they prevent it from being fodder is both with a fantastic voice cast, and it's a genuinely charming movie, actually has a, a nice mystique to it, uh, has a good atmosphere, which is definitely supplied by the animation team, because they just make things really creepy. It, and it's not scary, per se, but it can be eerie at times, but it, for the most part, it, it's, almost, it's much lighter than Coraline, I think, where it it seems it's just more fun, and uh, and it's an enjoyable, adventurous movie. I think kids will enjoy it. Parents should too. Uh, there's some pretty good humor in there. The voice cast: uh, Leslie Mann, John Goodman, Casey Affleck. Yeah, even Chris Merman's Plast. So a really great cast. Uh, pretty well written. <laughs> And it's an all-around enjoyable movie. Uh, at times, it's just really average, though. It's just not that risk-taking at times and settles instead of being a little more ambitious. But it's okay. It's not quite a great movie because it doesn't really try to get there. But it is good. It's enjoyable, fun movie. I liked it. And great animation. So I'm going to give this movie an 8 out of 10. Really enjoyable. <laughs> You know, for parents with kids that at some point are like, hey, you know, I hang out with dead people, I feel like the following conversation should take place. Listen, son or daughter, not really sure, trying to be, you know, generic here for, you know, multiple uses, uh, about the whole, you know, I talk, I see, you know, dead people, <sighs> Necrophilia is just not socially acceptable anymore. I know it's inviting, it's simple, easy, uh, just it's a little repugnant. I know you got the hormones and stuff, but it's, it's just a little too macabre.